Kausap pa rin po natin si uh, former Senator Eva Estrada Calao. And uh, Senator Calao, um, um, we've, we've heard many things about what happened uh, during the arrival of Senator Ninoy from the U.S. back to the Philippines. And uh, there have been different narratives, different stories, different tales. From your perspective, um, ano ho ba nangyari dun sa pagbalik ni Senator Ninoy Aquino? At least in your recollection. Uh, natatandang ko na looking at his face when he was last back there, uh -huh. he began to feel later on as we came as he came near the Philippines that something will happen. Very pensive siyang garon. Kasi two, two uniformed officials uh -huh. went into his plane when it landed yes. and inspected something. Nagdududod sa tumitingin siya ganun. May nag, nagkaroon siya ng nandudad. Na may niya, mangyayari sa kanya? Oh, something is happening. Something will happen. Uh -huh. well, were you, did you get the chance to be in touch with him when he was abroad in the U.S.? Uh, in whatever form of way? Um, Nag-uusap ba yung pamilya ninyo? Or? I think I have a letter. A few. Uh -huh. oh. That's a very Sometimes he letter. writes, no. Sometimes he writes me and the rest. Okay. Hindi lang ako and the rest like uh, uh -huh. all the others uh -huh. who are involved. He writes me and then I pass the letter around. Okay. Ganun na lang. Uh -huh. nung, nung nalaman yung babalik siya, um, sinalubong ko siya, pumaroon ako doon. You were in, you were in uh, Naia, uh, Naia, no? Naia oh. 1, ano? Sino kong kasama nyo sila, ang mga Aquino? Oo, oh, oh. mga, mga pinsan, mga kapatid. We were ready to see Ninoy. Okay. Yeah. Nagplano ko kay, sino kong nagplano nung arrival honors nung, ano, nung for uh, Senator Ninoy? I was. Kayo? I organized it, oo. Okay. Sino-sino pa ko yung... May grupo-grupo. May grupo-grupo to meet him. Aha. Wala. Akala, hindi nila alam na pinatay na siya doon. Nagmamarcha pala. Nagmamarcha pa according to how I arranged it to receive him. Nagmamarcha uh -huh. pa, pero pinatay na. Uh -huh. Si Laurel was also there po? Mm. Okay. And then si Doña... Do, 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 Aurora. Do, Doña Aurora was also there? I, I imagine she was. I can't remember now. Okay. And then, nung, nung sinabi sa inyo na napas lang po siya, tandong kayo sa loob ng kwarto, Uh, how did you how did you how did you receive the news parang eh why did this happen talagang something unusual yun umuwi yung pobre ng tao pero tapos biglang papatayin mo those pero may sensing siya eh okay uh, if you flash back certain movies Doon sa him. video, Bakit sa video niya. Makikita mo oh. sa mukha niya eh. Nakaganyan siya. Nag... Na-sense niya? Oh, you can see it in his face. Did, did, did the opposition uh, have any plans after the assassination of Nino Aquino? Were there any new plans that, uh, or were there meetings that were conducted? That uh, Was there any agenda that you decided to do after uh, the assassination of Nino Aquino? Hindi ko matandaan, pero magulo. There was nothing talagang arregladong gagawin namin. Oh. Magulo. Nataranta din kami. Nataranta din? Uh, mm -hmm. Okay. Nothing clear? Mm -hmm. Sabog. Nobody was uh, knew the directions. Okay. That was really unfair to do that to Ninoy. He was just coming home. Uh -huh. Tapos pababaril mo pa pa. I, I foul, would, foul in every sense. I would like to presume you you visited Santo Domingo and you visited Time Street of also. Of course, of course. Uh -huh. In fact, babantay ako eh. Meron kaming grupong nagbabantay din. Okay. Sa kanya, patay na. Last thing we did for him. What what uh, personal impressions did you get uh, the first time you saw the, the open casket? Because uh, I remember, I think there was a debate whether to keep it open or to close it, and then I think... Doña Aurora preferred to keep it open so that the entire country can see what, what was done to his son. Uh, how did, 
what was your own personal reaction when you saw the, the, the body? I can't remember now, but so, uh, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. Kayo po, uh, what was your parang ang naramdaman ninyo? Na ano kayo, nagalit kayo, nasaktan kayo, masama ang loob ninyo nung nakita nyo yung... Masama ang loob. Masama ang loob ninyo. Pinsan ko yan eh. Is, uh, our family is a very closely knit family. There are three sisters. One is, you know, his grandmother, mine is another, and one is uh, this uh, doctor who is now very famous, who who is uh, called in Russia to cure him, Dr. Uh -huh. I can't remember his name, but he's uh -huh. my cousin. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And then in 1984 po, nagkaroon ng eleksyon, yung um, Batasang Pambansa eleksyon, where uh, I think, if I remember right, the UNIDO fielded about candidates all over the country, and then nanalo po tayo ng, I think, siguro 60, no? There were 60, 60 opposition candidates. Opposi uh -huh. Hindi na kayo tumakbo noon, ano? You decided to just to help mm -mm. in the organization. Mm -mm. Hindi niyo naisip uh, at that time you're holding residence San Juan ho kayo noon, ano? That's right, man. That's right. And you preferred not to run at that time. Mm, I don't know if I preferred, but I did not run. Tumulong na lang kayo. Kahit ho uh, at that time eh matatawag natin the KBL was really lording it over. The opposition still decided to field candidates. Oh, yeah. That's a duty of the opposition. Uh -huh. No choice, Jan. Because uh, why, uh, why, despite the fact that the lack of funds, the media was muzzled by the KBL? No choice. What, no what, choice. what, what, what prompted the... Uh, no choice. We have to do it. And the... Kami kami na contribution. Okay. We had to give our own money. Okay. To finance the opposition. Malaki-laki din ang binibigay namin. They were, the others, it was quite a sacrifice for them. It was not, it was easy for me because my husband was cooperating. Ano? Wala ko nung kailangan. Ano, ano, sige, bigyan mo. Wala, sige. Okay. My husband was not clearly by shown, but he did a lot. He funded a lot. And so, I I even despite the obstacles of uh, the media being muzzled, television was controlled by them, and then uh, they had the, the, the wherewithals for, for fi funding a, a great campaign, lumaban pa rin ho ang Unido at, ka at kayo? Oh, no choice. No choice. Who will be the opposition? Hindi kami lalaban. And you fielded a complete slate all over the country? Of course. Of course, that's part of the work. We cannot say, oh, you need to lang lang. No, that's part of the work. We had to do it that way. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Sa Batangas yata, eh, if I'm not mistaken, tatlo ang nanalo. Tatlo ba o apat? But, uh, Sino yan? Oh. And then sa Quezon, eh, I think, eh, apat din na nakapasok sa mga Quezon Province, ano, sila Congressman Inverga, si K.O. Casantos, Mabuti ka ba pa, natatandaan mo. <laughs> oh, ay, ay, uh, na, natatanda ko po yun dahil uh, ako ho ang nag-proclaim sa kanila. <laughs> ako ho pinapunta ng partido. <laughs> Kasi hindi ho makapunta yung mga mga mabibigat na tao doon at mag-proclaim sa kanila. Kaya ako na lang ang pinapunta. <laughs> so, Mabigat ka naman din eh. Hindi <laughs> ka naman. Dapat ho si, kayo po o si Senator Laurel lang pumunta doon para mag-proclaim. Eh ako na lang ang pinapunta. Eh sinuerte naman po, nanalo lahat ng mga kandidato ng oposisyon. In Talaga. Quezon. Eh sa Batangas, where we expected yata, eh, everybody was supposed to to win, eh may isa pang nakapasok. <laughs> there was one who was able to to make it. How would you gauge po yung naging performance ho nung ano, nung malaki po na itulong nung presence nung 60 opposition members sa, sa Batasan po, ano? Of course, that's a good number. Despite the fact that, ano, no, na kontrolado, KBL, and then 60 is better than, than nothing, no? It's, it's necessary. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Malaking change ang ginawa ni Marcos in the structure of the Senate. Uh -huh. Malaking change ginawa niya, pero that's his role. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And then from there po, mapunta naman tayo from 
sa 19 ano oh, sa 19 uh, 86 uh, snap elections. Ano po ang naging papel ng um, ng ni, ni Senator Calo doon sa 1986 snap election po? 1986. Yes, snap elections po. Si 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 Cory Tubakbong. Do you remember po nag medyo nagkaroon ng ng harapan si Doyle Laurel with uh, with President uh, Cory noon kung sino ang magiging official candidate ng opposition. If you remember right, medyo nagkaroon ng the opposition could not decide who would be the official candidate. Was it going to be Cory or Doy? Uh, how was that uh, eventually resolved po? If, if, if you can just recall. Kung sino magiging kandidato? Yes, yes, yes. Paano nga pa nangyari yun? If you can, if, kung matatandaan nyo na lang po. Kasi ang nangyari po yata dun eh, si Vice President Laurel, uh, si, si Laurel po nag giveaway uh, kay, kay, kay Cory Aquino po. That's the reason why there was uh, Cory Aquino ended up becoming part of the UNIDO. I can't remember now. Hindi nyo na masyadong ma mm. ma matandaan ho, no? Mm. And then, nga pala ho, maitanong ko sa inyo, paano ho si, si Erap na pasok po naging senador? Kayo ho ang isa sa mga staunch supporter ho ni President Erap? Para maging senador Para siya? Para maging senador. O kasi di ba tumakbo po kayong senador din nung GAD, nung mm. 1987. Oh. Do, do you remember that with, mm. uh, with Teng Puyat po? Oo. Oh. Paano ko ba nangyari yun na si ano si uh, si si Erap eh, na, napasok bilang senador? I think you supported him to become a, a, a member of the Grand Alliance for Democracy. I can't remember but uh, madaling madaling si Erap makapasok because he was a very popular man eh. Okay. So it was easy to get him because of his popularity. Paano ko ang naging relasyon niyo with uh, with uh, Erap doon? Because I think you were very close to 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 Era po. How would how would you characterize your relationship with 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 then just Mayor Era? Wherever I could help him, I was pushing to. I wanted the Era to really get in more. But but you knew him way back. Oh yes, because we are both from San Juan. Ah okay. Oh. Ever since when he was mayor, magkakilala na kayo. Oh, matagal ko nang kilala si Era. Hindi pa ko kayo, Senador, noon magkakilala na kayo. Neighbors kami sa San Juan eh. Ah, talaga ko ah. Mm -mm. And you are close to his family as well? Ah, yeah. Okay. San Juan kami pareho niyan eh. Okay, okay. Neighbors and parang sabay kami kalakayan. Even when you were Senator, eh, you were still in touch? Ah, yeah, because we were neighbors in San Juan. Okay. We were in touch very often. Si 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 Era po ba was si Liberal Party o Nationalista? I I I do not remember anymore. Era? Ano ho ba siya? Parang nationalista ho yata kasi parang close siya yata sa kay kay President Marcos noon, ano? Nationalista. He was very close to President Marcos. How how was he as a mayor in San Juan po? How who? How was uh, uh, Joseph Estrada as mayor of San Juan? Okay siya. Okay, uh, regular si yung group niya, yung pamilya niya is okay in San Juan. He was uh, he was doing very well. Mm. Even the wife and si Eloy. The wife. Uh, We're talking about Doctor Eloy. Mm. Para mali para mali na ako kasi mahirap na ako. Si Doctor yeah, Eloy accept, close accepted. din po kay kay Doctor Eloy. Accepted then. Mm. Acceptable. Uh -huh. Si 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 Lito Atienza po. E eh, tao niyo rin po. Lito Atienza. Naging mayor po ng Manila. Oo nga pala, no? <laughs> Oo nga. <laughs> Mabuti yung matatandaan po ninyo dahil... At may age, I have to oh, recall. Il ilan taon na po kayo ngayon? Give, make your guess. I, 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 mahirapan po ako mag-guess. Yes, come on. Don't flatter yourself. Uh, I, 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 Don't well, flatter can, me. Don't uh, flatter all me. All I can say is 80s po. That's all. I cannot, I cannot anymore. I'm 92. Ah, 92 na po kayo, ah. 92 pa. Wow. Talagang... That's amazing. <laughs> Matibay. <laughs> Pati may baho talaga. Si Lito Atienza po ay sumikat sa politika dahil sa inyo. Sino? Si Lito Atienza po sumikat dahil sa inyo. Because... Talaga? Yes, because kayo po ang nagsumuporta sa kanya na I think maging dyan sa Manila, na tumakbo yata sa Manila. If I'm not remember or maging OIC or something like that. I cannot, I cannot, I cannot, I cannot recall. Oo, Lito Atienza. Pero liberal party ho yata siya, no? 
si Dito? Yes, I think he was Liberal Party. I can't remember, but oh. anyway, I did help him. Some people say that um, you are the, open close quotation mark, Liberal Party that stayed in the Philippines. I was nationalist. Oh, uh. oh, pero some people dub you as the Liberal Party who stayed in the Philippines because the original Liberal Party left for abroad. Sila Roja, sila, uh, oh, mga, yung mga, oh, they disappeared. They, 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 they all left for, for, for the, abroad. Their, their own states. Oh, Many tama. of the, the hierarchy of the, except for Ninoy, of course, no, he, he stayed. Pero kayo po, parang, kayo ang parang original na, na tumayong parang liberal party nala kasi parang walang natira wala, sa kanila oh, dito. Tama, eh. tama. Kayo ang naging parang pseudo-liberal party dito. Tama. Uh, especially when Ninoy left. Because kayo ang inadapt ni ni. Kasi ni I was not acceptable to Marcos, eh. mm -hmm. so I ended up being with the liberals. Mm -hmm. Although I'm nationalist, ah, okay. I'm a guest candidate of the liberals. But you never transferred, po, no? No, never I never. I was never. I was never became liberal. I'm always nationalist. Ah. But since Marcos never wanted me, so I went with the liberals. But I was a nationalist with Do the liberals. You never changed party affiliation. No. I was a nationalist with the liberals. Ano kung, ano kung, Just candidate ako nila. Anong insidente po ang nangyari kung bakit ayaw ni Marcos sa inyo? Inatake niyo po siya um, sa politika or... Ano nga ba't ayaw ni Marcos? Anong mga issues po ang, mga, ang natatandaan niyo lang mo? At least more or less? I don't know, but... Uh, there, were, there were certain issues that you probably could not agree with him. Yeah, Marcos? Marcos, yes. Sa politika, sa pamamalakad niya? Ayaw niya ako maging kandidata eh. Ah, talaga. Sino ko naging kandidato niya? Ewan ko, meron siya listahan. I'm supposed to be a candidate, but he did not take me. So what the liberals did, they invited me instead. So I became a candidate of the Liberal Party. Okay. You were always a nationalista from day All one? All the time. Even if, uh, even if I was working with the liberals, I had counted myself as a nationalist with the liberals. I see. Even even before Marcos, you were always a nationalist. Mm -hmm. I never changed party. Okay. Ang mga pamilya ko noon, the families before were always identified by their political affiliations. Well, yes. That was the time before, no? Mm -hmm. Ngayon hindi na ho ganoon. Ma Malaking bagay yun noon. Oo. Oh, oh. To what party you belong. Yeah, Ngayon, ang pamilya tinatanong, no? Oh. Ngayon palipat-lipat. Oo. Oh, oh. oh, so, what can you say about that? Yung, yung, yung current political party system natin po? Magulo. You cannot predict. Is it good for our democracy? Well, po, it's, it's uh, one of the experiences we have to go through as a democracy. We will learn eventually. Some people say that this is part of the evolution that eventually will wake up and mm -hmm. then realize Correct. that we have to go back to the two-party system. Mm -hmm. Correct. What do you think, ma'am? Uh, do you think we should... I think a two-party system is healthier. It says for or against. Okay. Hindi yung merong hindi mo alam kung ano. It's for against any issue. How would you characterize your Senate before compared to the Senate today? I'm a good Senate before. <laughs> <laughs> not that I'm not that I'm. I, I agree with you. I agree oh. with you. Oh, oh hindi mo. Ba bakit yung po na sabi yung 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 mga senador noon talagang magagaling po. Pati yung mga presidente noon magagaling din. Ba bakit yun ang sabi? Hindi by popularity sila. They're not voted by popularity. They are voted by their performance. Magagaling, kakayahan, oh, no? Hindi ngayon popular ka, so whatever you stand for, basta popular ka, gusto ka lang tao. Would, would it, it, was not, it was not popularity. Would, would it be correct to say na mas matatalino yung mga presidente at mga senador noon? Hindi naman, pero they are not... Uh, hindi... Hindi ala chamba that they're there. <laughs> hindi ala chamba, okay. Hindi ba? <laughs> Okay. Hmm. Ngayon ho, parang pa pasikatan. Hindi ko alam kung nagpapasikatan sila, but they must stand for a purpose why they're there. Okay. Ba't ka nandyan? Ano bang gusto mong gawin dyan? Oo. Eh kung magpapasikat ka lang just because you want to be one of those, you know? Okay. Huwag na lang. What for? Oh. Sayang yung seat na yun. You can give it to somebody who can do It's better. It's more worthy. Yeah. Okay. Well... Uh, maraming maraming salamat uh, Tita Eva, no? I'd like to call you Tita Eva Maraming maraming salamat, thank you very much for uh, for taking the time out
Uh, well, let me say this. Uh -huh. I want to thank you instead. Ah, hindi ba? I'll tell you why. Uh -huh. Because uh, it's good that I can also give past experiences to the new de generation. Yes, yes. Talk about it at least. And then, of course, I want to know what's going on. So yes. you're asking me this, this uh, conversation uh -huh. tells me more or less what's In going on. In a sense, on. yes. Uh -huh. It's a very good opportunity. Thank you for this. Marami po salamat. Thank, thank you. you for that. Well, uh, it's been a privilege, po. it's been a very privilege, uh, my personal privilege, uh, sharing um, this hour with uh, a 92-year-old lady. Uh, how many people can be as lucky as I am? Marami, marami salamat po. And uh, ito po si Eric Espina, palagi pong nagsasabi sa inyo, magmasid, makialam, higit sa lahat po ay manindigan. Dahil wala pong magmamahal sa Pilipino kung hindi ang, ang Pilipino. Pilipino. Uh -oh. Dagang salamat, mahing gabi, kaninyong tanan.